No game this weekend. Is that going to be a welcome break after an intense start to the season? Yeah, I think it is. Um, we've had a hard run of games over the last few weeks and we're lucky really that we didn't have the midweek this week, which would have added to that. But yeah, it'd be nice for us to kind of reset everything and especially with four draws back to back now, I think it's time for us to have that period of time to really focus on what we can do better to turn those one points into three. And you've had a really positive impact here, four assists, but also you dropped into centre back last week. You know, is that something you bring to this squad? You're really diverse, you can play in lots of different positions. Yeah, I'm willing to do whatever I need to for the team. And having played there when I was probably a lot younger than I am now, um, it was comfortable for me. You know, it's not something that was strange for me to do. And I'm, like I said, I'm happy to do that for the team. And um, I'm just glad that I can contribute however possible, whether that is assists or changing the position for the team. Like I said, from day one when I've been here, you know, I will give everything for this team. And if that's how I'm going to do it, then I'm happy to do that. Yeah, and you've played with new signing Aisha before at Craw Crawley Wasps. What can she bring to this team? And are you excited to link up with her again? Yeah, it's um, nice to see her around again. Um, we had a bit of a conversation when, we, when I told her I was leaving Crawley and, you know, she was very complimentary of me um, my relationship with her and that was a bit of a um, I don't know it was strange for me because I've never really had that kind of link with a player before and for her to you know want to come here and has spoken already about being working with me again is great and you know she's a great player she's a fantastic talent for her age and it's about her you know working hard within the team that we've got and you know, fitting into our style of play, which is very different to Crawley, and I've said that since I've been here, it's very different to how we were at Crawley. So it's going to be a challenge for both of us, you know, to get that link back that we had. But it's definitely something that this club will thrive off of, really, when she's hitting her top form. Yeah, she spoke about you as a as a role model in many aspects, and I think you know from the from the stand you can see that on the pitch. You're a real real leader out there, aren't you? Yeah, I'm glad that I have that role, and players kind of can feel that from me. You know, despite everything, in terms of me not being here that long. Um, it's nice to know that I have that impact on the team and I'm just happy with the effect that I'm having on people at the club and if that's how people view me then I'm very, very touched by that yeah. and obviously, you know, I just want to keep myself nice and grounded and just offer, you know, my knowledge and my support to every single player at this club, whether that's first team reserves or younger players below that. And finally, Portsmouth, the weekend after, there's no line. That's going to be a really, really big game, isn't it? Yeah, massive. You know, they've really done well at the start of the season. Um, maybe some people have doubted them in terms of their abilities over the last few years. But, you know, Jay's a smart manager and they've got Kim, who's a fantastic assistant manager in there as well. And the style of players they've got is very, very diverse across the team. And, you know, they're scoring goals for fun when they're at home. And, you know, they are going to be a tough side. And they've always been tough whenever I've played against them over the years. They're a very, very tough side. So... We know we need to be on our A game and being at home again is going to be massive for us. But um, yeah, it's going to be a tough game. We know there's a lot at stake. We want to get three points, like I keep saying. Um, Portsmouth aren't going to want to drop off yeah. any points. So it's a big game early on in the season, but something we can definitely get momentum from after this two-week break.